the dynamic duo of academic writers, is referencing and paraphrasing. Referencing, is a formal feature of academic writing. It indicates where writers, have used information or ideas, generated by others, in their texts. There are several styles of referencing. For example, Chicago, APA, and Vancouver. Here is an example of the Chicago referencing style. The referencing style comprises two parts, the in-text citations, and the reference list. The reference list, and in-text citations, must match. Referencing is used to acknowledge, the source of the information or ideas, that you have chosen to use, in your academic writing. It is used to create strong arguments, that are supported by evidence, not just telling your lecturer what you have read. Referencing is used to support your key message, not simply describe other people's ideas or words. It is also used to integrate the ideas of others into your own argument. Why is referencing important? Science, is an evidence-based discipline. Therefore it is important, that scientists use evidence from the work of others, to support their ideas. Paraphrasing is an important aspect of referencing. When you want to use information and ideas from published sources, you need to express them in your own words, by paraphrasing. The focus of paraphrasing, is to keep original meaning, but present the information in a new form. Here is an example of paraphrasing. The original text is, koalas like eucalyptus leaves, and they can consume 500 grams of food a day. The paraphrased version of this sentence is, a koala, can eat up to 500 grams of eucalyptus leaves, every day. In this version, the meaning is retained but the focus of the sentence is different. Merely substituting, and changing the order of words is not acceptable. The purpose of academic writing, is not to report or repeat the findings, or interpretations, of other writers, it is to discuss and comment on these findings and interpretations. In academic writing, your work should say something new or show what you understand about a subject. To create a strong piece of academic writing, you need to paraphrase information to support your ideas. You also need to indicate where you found that information. Referencing and paraphrasing are dynamic, because you can't do one, without the other. If you are not paraphrasing, or acknowledging other writers' ideas, then you are plagiarizing passing someone else's work off as your own. This is a violation of the standards of academic integrity.